Eh, saca, 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 saca. Well done, guys. We're so proud of you. Well done, well done, guys. Thank you very much. You're welcome. This is a, a deputy. I call this guy. You're welcome. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Of course, you are now very senior members of the right. So, please come. Welcome. Thank you. Thank you very much. You're welcome. This is a, a deputy. I call this You're welcome. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Of course, you are now very senior members of the So, please come. Welcome. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you very much, uh, Mr. Nomikampo. Compatriots, it's a pleasure to have you here as the Chancellor of the Ghana High Commission in the United Kingdom. And to our compatriots from Ghana, the 10,000 kilometer expedition. <laughs> You're welcome. Sometime late last week, I had 
the message that and the message that some Ghanaians were embarking on a trip from Accra to London. <coughs> of course, someone just called me and informed me. Later, I'm monitoring the media. I heard that they were somewhere that they were being interviewed on PZFF. So, who were following their steps, their travels. And I said to myself, this is interesting. Sometimes we only think that it's the Europeans that embark on some adventures. But it's good to know that there are others, including Ghanaians, who are able to embark on something to my mind that has never happened before. And of course, we heard they were coming across the channel. So, staff of the mission together with many Ghanaians and others. Better. And I felt that it was right and proper as a representative of Ghana in the United Kingdom to invite them both. Hence their presence here this afternoon. And of course, I thought that this should also be an opportunity for all who are interested in coming home to be able to do so. <laughs> so it's not only the media, other compatriots and I think you know others online have the opportunity to also interact with them. But I don't know, you will tell your story. But for me, as a representative of God, the start. I must say that we are very proud of you. And apart from the fundraising bid, which is laudable, you also represent the Ghanaian spirit. Which is that you may be in Ghana, but you can conquer the world. You may be in Ghana, but you can also be competitive globally. You may be in Ghana when you dream and you are focused, you can achieve it. These are some of the values that we take from this expedition of yours. It also tells us that as Ghanaians we must dare. We should not limit ourselves to our comfort zone. We must dare. Believe in ourselves that if we are determined, we can achieve it. And that message to me is very relevant in these times where we know that we are facing economic and social challenges in our country. If some of our good patrons have been able to dream and achieve it, these are collectively as a nation. If we put our minds to it, we can make our nation a place where others will come to see great things that we are doing.
Uh, we have here the uh, Deputy High Commissioner, Mrs. Rita Tanini, and the Acting Head of Chance Minister Councillor Dolly Opokudapa. And we have uh, Rear Admiral. <laughs> yeah, Rear Admiral Edu. Yes, he is a defense attorney. He is one of two Rear Admirals of the Ghana Navy. The Chief of Defense Staff is a Rear Admiral, and you are. Yeah. <laughs> yes. So it tells you he's a very, very senior member of the Ghana. Of course, we have the uh, public affairs and information officer, and those in the we have others to be here. But of course, we also have very senior community leaders. I can see uh, community archbishop reformers. <laughs> Also, yeah, uh, a member, a member of the leadership of Ghana Union UK. I also have, uh, uh, I think, uh, very senior social workers here. But you're all welcome to the High Commission. I know that it's not always that we are honoured to have you here. We do our doors are always open, but our gallant adventurers have given us the opportunity as a high commission to have this event. So I call on the leader 